Looks, it says we can do this one. Where is it? Oh, it's up here. But Amber's in my party. In fact, okay, doppelgangers. Hey, traveler! I've been looking for you everywhere. How's that wind glider I gave you last time? <laughs> Seems like it's really growing on you. But then again, you don't have a gliding license, do you? Why didn't you mention that when you first gave a it to me? A gliding license? Oh, isn't it obvious? You gotta have a gliding license to legally glide in Mondstadt. We've been breaking the law this whole time. Oh, but we've been gliding for ages now. This is the first we've heard about it. Yeah, you've been gliding all over the place. Everyone's noticed. <laughs> So, you came looking for us because you want to give us a gliding license? No way! The Knights of Avonius have strict rules! Yeah, but it can't you be that hard. You need to pass an exam, and only then will the Knights issue your license. Okay. Today, I'm here as an examiner to oversee your official gliding exam. Good. I gave you your wind glider, so this is my responsibility. At least that's what acting Grandmaster Jean would say. An exam?! <sighs> what a pain in the butt! I'm sure you'll glide I, through it. I can't imagine it's that difficult. I mean, the whole city saw how well you flew the But we do need to... Here, take this gliding manual. No need to memorize. For example, only one person per wing glider. No carrying anything over the set weight limit. No taking off no using, taking an, off animal using slime, an animal so slime. So what? Anyway, but how am I supposed sure to do to Breath it, of the okay? Wild style I shenanigans? I had to read a load of big, thick books too when Lisa was teaching me magic. Wow, that's a big old book! Paimon thinks we best get started. Great, come find me when you're done. I'll be at Windrise. Wait, why can't we just start it right now? You just said you were here to do it. <sighs> the Knights of Avonius. <laughs> yeah, obviously we're cutting the black of that. Oh! It's a cutscene. Across the land. Birds that yearned for the sky had wings, but no way to fly. They ask the animal god, how can we reach the heavens? To which the animal god replied, you have yet to find that which is most important. As the god spoke, the wind thrust the seeds of a dandelion high into the sky. The birds thrust out their wings, but the breeze was all too mild, leaving them to stumble across the earth. So they went to the gorge, where the wind showed off its wild and incomparable strength. They threw themselves off the cliff and flapped their wings amongst the howling winds until they were able to fly freely in the sky. To the animal god they went to gleefully say, We understand now. All we needed was a stronger wind to fly. In reply, the animal god said, What you lacked was not wind, but courage. It is courage that has allowed you to become the first flying birds of this world. Burbs. Hmm, that's a cool story. But is the knight's gliding manual really written in that style? Uh... Yes. Huh. Okay. Chapter 1, Act 1. We're in Courage and Wings, alright. Um... I'll pass for right now. Why is it not on my map? Wait, oh, it's way down here? Okay, sure. This is the popular teleport these days. Looks like we're gonna jump off a cliff from where that's positioned.
Random fire? Okay. Is there a thing right here? Oh, it's down the cliff. Or whatever, I'm not dealing with that right now. Wait, can't I get this with, uh, this girl? Back off! Cool downs. What did that do, though? Whatever. Oh, it decayed. Weird. Rage, you're here. Did you have a good read through of the gliding manual? Got all the rules? Sounds like it was a real drag. Ah, oh, the gliding manual is super dry. I really? Hmm. That cool stories? Oh, you must mean the example cases in the appendix. Some of them I like. My favorite one is about the illegal animo slime takeoff. Right? Apparently, if you pop an animo slime and take off in the burst of wind, it shoots you up really, really high. I really want to try it. Yeah, I think it was describing this earlier, and I didn't really understand how to do it. I should probably experiment no, at some point, though. No, not that story. Paimon meant the one with the little bird who wanted to learn to fly. Uh, what? Let me take a look. Oh, shoot. This is the storybook I used to read as a kid. Oops, sorry. I put both books in the same <laughs> pile. And how in the heck do you confuse a bedtime story with an instruction manual? It's, Paimon's a real question. I mean, that's legit. Uh, uh, it's because maybe deep down inside, that fairy tale is the thing that truly taught me how to glide. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> what you lacked was not wind. It's courage that's allowed you to become the first flying birds of this world. <laughs> That's so stupid. Reading that gave me the courage to glide, to become an outrider, and to become the gliding champion of Mondstadt. Uh, but anyway, let's get back to the exam. Sure, Amber. Don't be nervous. Just okay then. You just need to follow the marked route to the finish. Okie dokie. Where is it? Oh. Is there more? I, oh. Wait, what? Did I just die? That, Amber, what are you doing? I was just trying to descend like half an inch. Do I have to like, just tell- how do I even get back up there? I imagine it doesn't reset when you screw it up somehow. Dodge this. Yeah, okay, so it does actually knock you back, that's good. You gotta focus on if you want to try. Cool. I wasn't expecting it to be like going in multiple directions when everything you've done is just descending so far. Like, I guess this is fine. I just feel like I'm gonna miss rings. Yeah, I did miss rings, didn't I? I missed, like, half those rings. How are you supposed to do that, then? <coughs> I guess you need to wait to descend until you're actually gonna hit all the rings. I don't know why it forces you to fly up immediately before doing that part, though. It's kind of annoying.
Ah, I think the chest. Whatever. It'll be there. Yeah, this is just... You gotta focus on your technique if you wanna try For, like, what's basically a flying tutorial, I was expecting it to be more straightforward and less kind of cool. weird. Yep. Like, this is an unusually elaborate flying exercise for, like, the first one you ever do. Like, I did hit all those rings, right? Like, you need the little bit of updraft to do anything, but then you need to immediately descend again to then go back up again using the ring acceleration. It's just kind of weird. There, I think going this way is a little better. No, but no, it lifts me up again. There's like a lift up right before. How are you supposed to descend into it to get the rings? See, this part makes more sense. Do I, like... Where is she? Oh, here we go. You nailed it! But it's no surprise, given the way you handle... The next part of the exam is in Mondstadt. See you there. Don't keep me waiting! So why don't we just go with you? Alrighty then. You heard her. Back to the city! Let's not keep her waiting! Well, maybe you get that chest first. Assuming it's still there. Yeah, I, I know that space bar generally takes you out of glider for a second, but it was, uh, I don't know. Like, if there's an updraft right there, it's not going to help any. Like, you have to get out of the updraft before removing the glider would work. At least it teleports you back so you don't have to climb up again every time you fail. Now we can teleport. Oh, I suppose we can't just teleport right here. Yeah, I have to teleport here. I'm glad I picked this up. I mean, I think it's nice, at least, that not every early game quest is all revolving around basic combat. Like, usually in other games, at this point, you'd still be doing combat tutorials. Where did she... Did I run past it? How did I run past it? Oh, is it, like, inside the building or something? Or what's going on? and get to the finish without stopping in the middle. Okay. <sighs> uh... Love Draft is annoying when you don't need it, and then ignores you when you do need it. Like, look, I'm in the middle of the updraft. Why is it not taking me up? I don't even see the next part. Oh, over here. That wasn't nearly as bad as the other one. Oh, but her spawn location is different now. Now, let's do the yeah, I was just clicking the wrong button. Easy! You've one 
Once you've passed this final stage, you'll just keep thinking about that license. Ready? Is it gonna make me climb the wall? Whoa. I guess it does make you climb the wall, because otherwise you start too low. See, there needs to be a dance button for when there's nothing to do except wait for a timer to run out. Unless I can get this with updrafts again somehow. But I'm assuming not. Yeah, no. Not high enough. This probably is not even a difficult one either. It's just uh, starting it wrong means you immediately lose. Yeah, this one's super easy, it's just you have to start it right. <laughs> That's the only part that matters. Windborne Traveler! You are required to land at once by the order of the Knights of Favonius. I am Otto of the Knights of Favonius. Uh? Please, show me your gliding license. It is against the law to glide without a license. You have the right to remain silent. Wait, I'm an instructor. This is a gliding exam. Oh. Well, you picked a bad time to hold your gliding exam. Really? What? The Knights of Favonius received a report from a sister at the cathedral, claiming she saw Raptor gliding around these parts. Raptor? A known criminal in Mondstadt. He always uses a wind glider to commit his crimes, so pe Wow, he flies- So far, we haven't managed to catch him. Our plan this time was to draw him into the cath- But he is- Fortunately, one of the sisters put some secret mark- But he was too fast, and we couldn't even keep up with the trail the markings left behind. Wow, these guys are bad at flying. Well, if you need help chasing down a gliding criminal, I'm the one for the job. So- As far as I know, he was last seen near Springvale. Leave it to me. With us chasing him down together, he doesn't stand a chance. Once we've got this raptor guy, but no need to worry. I'll be sure to have a word with Jean. So do we need to talk to Jean? No, we can just go right here. Okay. Where are you? This is Springvale. There must be some clues about Raptor around here. The sister from the cathedral put some secret animal markings. Use your elemental sight and keep your... Ooh! Hey! What do you think this is? It looks like a broken tree branch. Oh, Paimon knows! It's from a frame of a wind glider, therefore... There are no elemental traces on it. Oh, it looks like it's just a plain old tree branch. What am I supposed to be looking for? I kind of just like the buttons they ask you to hold. Like, middle mouse is annoying. Anything involving middle mouse is just always dumb. Hmm. A strip of cloth with animal markings on it. Looking at the design and the way it's woven, there's a good chance it came from a wind glider. Wow, Outriders have to be textile experts now? It's a harder job than Paimon thought. If this really belongs to Raptor, it must mean his wind glider is broken.
mistake. Eggs. Man, this is making me hungry. I'm like about to go cook some eggs right here. I wish I might have the eggs for dinner. I'm gonna have steak and eggs. It's gonna be wild. Oh yeah, I actually don't need to do this one anymore. Okay. Animo nonsense. Where's this last clue? I feel like I'm leaving Springvale, like, weren't the other two clues in Springvale? I feel like I've gone too far at this point. Whoa! This thing actually fights you? I was not expecting it to actually charge. That was hilarious. I love how it says raw meat when it's in the middle of a fire. I mean, I guess it wouldn't cook that fast, but it's still kind of funny. Oh, it's marked? It wasn't marked before, what? This game. Hmm. How do we know if this was left by strange bird or an animal slimes are airborne creatures? They don't leave marks on the ground unless someone stumped on one to take off. That was weird. Paimon said strange bird, but the text said raptor. Like, they didn't have her say raptor? Hmm. Either way, let's make a mental note of these markings. They're very clear. It appears that the elemental markings point this way. Huh. Well, do you think he ran off ahead? There's only one way to find out. Wow, Amber. Come on. We should keep following them. Ooh, what's that? Looks. It sounds like there's a battle going quick. That's just where I was, probably, huh? Yep. Or like five feet from where I just was. Goodness, the Knights of Favonius have arrived. The hilly trolls won't dare pursue me any longer. What happened? <sighs> hilly trolls? But I thought the Knights of Favonius had. It's a small camp not too far from the village. But the route. But today, oh, some crazy fellows. <laughs> <laughs> well, 
It really riled them up. They ch I managed to get away, but they smashed my fruit cart. I was just at your fruit cart. Oh, I literally I just looted your fruit cart. <laughs> Funny looking. In oh, he was holding on to something. Must have been heavy because he couldn't glide in. A Honestly, people like that shouldn't be allowed in the skies. It doesn't take a genius to know you're not supposed to carry heavy objects. Heavy object. Tell me, did you see? <laughs> it was so you obviously your guy. Uh, I managed to catch a glimpse as I ran from the hilly churls. Seems like a strong lead. Oh, and don't worry. As soon as I get. Do we have a marker? Ooh. Oh yeah, it's like right ahead. <laughs> oh. Hello. I got careless. Suffocate. Oops. Suffocate. Oh, so soft. You're open. Three. I guess I haven't done that elemental combo before. You're open. Suffocate. Finish off this guy. Stop changing targets when there's a guy at one life. Or maybe they just animate while they die or something. Not that. But yeah, they t they animate for like another second even after they're down, which is kind of distracting. I thought I'm looting bird eggs while I'm in the middle of a fight with five people. Apart from the hilly trolls, there's a bunch of funny-looking people too. You're just now doing the type of wind gliders they've got. Say this lot is with Raptor. A little late, huh? <laughs> but if that's the case, what are they hanging around here for? I wonder. Well, this measly bunch can't slow us down, that's for sure. I love how this these but voice lines all imply. <laughs> which means Raptor still has it on him. Oh, look where we are. Nice. The elemental power on the artifact. Raptor must have realized the markings would give that way when the effect wears off. He, he won't get away. Forget these guys. Come on. Let's keep following the elemental markings. Okay. So now it's just right here. Should I heal before this fight? And should I adjust weapons? I'm out of apples again, but I still got sensietas. Seems like this one is better, right? Or is Elemental Mastery better? Like this one does 39 base damage.
I feel like when I'm on a different menu, it tells you how much better the item is. Like if I'm here... No, it seems like it's the same. I thought there was some mem 